The investigation into the tragic death of South African soccer icon Senzo Meiwa advanced today as forensic pathologist Dr. Johannes Stinkham took the stand to provide crucial insight into the case. With a distinguished career spanning numerous autopsies, Dr. Stinkham's testimony shed light on the circumstances surrounding Meiwa's untimely demise. Dr. Stinkham revealed that he had meticulously examined Senzo Meiwa's body on October 28, 2014. His findings unveiled a single gunshot wound to Meiwa's chest, consistent with a contact shot. This means that the firearm had been pressed directly against Meiwa's body at the time of discharge. Stinkham says the bullet would have gone through the in milliseconds and the disease would have started bleeding immediately. The court adjourns for tea break before the defense starts cross-examination. The trajectory of the bullet was revealed to be from the front to the back, entering the chest and exiting through the back. The cause of the death was attributed to this gunshot wound, which significantly impacted the heart and lung. Dr. Stinkham estimated that Senzo Meiwa could have survived for only a brief period following the gunshot, stating, seconds, minutes, but definitely not hours. He also suggested that Meiwa might have moved forward and slightly bent at the waist if the assailant was standing directly in front of him. Alternatively, he might have attempted to push the firearm away from his body causing it to move downwards. The rapid progression of the bullet's trajectory would have caused immediate bleeding upon impact. Subsequently, the court adjourned for a break before the defense initiated cross-examination. According to Dr. Steenkamp's expert testimony, Senzo Meiwa was shot by someone who had managed to approach him closely. The ongoing inquiry continues to unravel the mysteries surrounding Meiwa's tragic death, and while the identity of the perpetrator remains unclear, Dr. Steinkamp's revelation provides crucial insights into the circumstances of the high-profile case. As the investigation unfolds, we will watch closely and hope that the perpetrators get caught and the high-profile case finally comes to a positive end.